All right, what's good, YouTube? We're here with uh, Slim and Asian Persuasion here with our top uh, YCS 32 profile. With what's your name, man? James Lawson. All right, man. Let's get into this profile. All right. So uh, first off, to start off, the cards everyone should be playing right now: two Max E, uh, the Terror Top Engine, uh, and then the Rat with a Whip Tail. Uh, if you don't play uh, these cards in your deck, you're probably not going to top an event. Totally I'm just letting you know right now. So I think so far, it's been almost yeah, all. every Except day. Yep. Except for VA. Uh, and then for the other engine in my deck, uh, it's going to be a little weird. I played 40 cards uh, before I say this. Uh, I played Infernoid, so I had two uh, Nuku, two Deviati, an Atondo, double Sidesmoth, Siet, double Petrulia, double Harmadic, uh, an Entra, and then of course three Decatron because that card's the nuts. Yes, sir. Um, I didn't feel like playing 60 because I don't want to rely on Mills to win, so I, I just decided to try and play 40 and resolve the Zodiac combo with the, the trap card that's really broken. Yeah. Uh, so for spells, I played three Barrage because this card's the nut, uh, three the thing that searches the trap card because, uh, mm -hmm. I don't know, got to play around Ghost Ogre with that too, so send Debbie Audi off a Decatron. Oh, yeah. uh, I played two of Void Imagination. Uh, uh, weirdly enough, I only summoned Tierra once throughout the entire tournament. Wow. Oh, wow. Uh, it turns out I didn't need it. Uh, then for spell, uh, the rest of it, I played uh, one upstart. Uh, consistency is key. Uh, I know they play upstart in the 60 card build, but like, I'm actually trying to be consistent. <laughs> Uh, I played Regeki because this card is too good. Uh, I played one for one. I would take it out like uh, really. I, like there was never a point where I wanted it. Uh, the, every time I drew it, it was like pretty much dead in my hand. Uh, I'd rather have like Book of Moon or, or a second of this card, uh, which is really really good. Uh, it was really good if I hard drew it with uh, the Feast, uh, and then just having it to play around like. Slumbers and stuff? Uh, yeah, to play around Slumbers and then um, anything that like it would stop my Decatron. And then uh, I had played two Void Feasts as the trap card. That was the only trap card I played. Uh, some people might criticize not playing Barrier, but like this card does so much that you don't even need the Barrier. Yeah. Uh, so do you want to do extra aside first? Shoes, man. All right. I will do extra first then. Sounds good. So for extra, I played Tierra. I made her once. Uh, she was. I mean, the, she would. She would have been broken if I made her more, but. Uh, it was okay. Uh, I played two Omega, mostly to send off Sierra. I hard made Omega like twice, uh, or sorry, three times, and it won me the game every time. Uh, I played three rank threes, uh, Invoker, Levier Dragon, and Totem Bird. Uh, shout out to my channel. Yeah, Levier, baby. Uh, I made this card more than I made this card, uh, and it won me a lot of games, like on an actual level. Uh, I don't know, it, it was just really good. Uh, then for my Zodiac stuff, I played one Borbo. Uh, I played two Tigris, which might seem a bit odd. I played one Borapol and two Dryden. So for the two Tigris, I didn't regret any point having a second Tigris in my extra. Like, it always got me there. If I was able to do the Emerald play and then uh, shuffle it all back and then do Tigris into the second uh, combo, I always won that game. Yeah. So like. It, it, it just got me there too many times to say it was like bad. Uh, and then for just rank fours, I played Emerald. I made it a, a good amount of times. Uh, I probably made it the same amount of times I made Kagetsuchi. Uh, this card's really good with Whiptail. Uh, like insanely good with Whiptail. Yeah, shit, it beat me so badly with that card. Uh, and then I played this card. I didn't make it. Uh, it's better if you're running Instant Fusion. Um, I didn't run Instant Fusion, so it probably should be like something good, like a Samurai for OTK options. Uh, this card was not good at all. I would not play it in the future. Uh, and then for my side deck, I had two Ghost Ogres. Uh, I thought about maining them. I kind of wanted to main them a lot, so I thought about playing 42 cards, but then I was just like, no, nah, I'm trying to be consistent. What's the point in ruining that? Uh, and it ended up working. I drew it when I needed it in, in, after I sided it, like honestly. Uh, it was pretty good. Uh, that's a good card. Uh, I played two Lancia for the 60 card match and uh, mirror match, anything. Uh, I played against Cosmos. It was the only si matchup I sided it against because uh, that was the only I didn't I didn't play any card. I didn't play 60 card decks. Uh, I just played a bunch of Zodiacs. Um, so it was, it would have been okay if I saw Infernoids, I'm sure, but it was not. Yeah. Uh, I played two of this card just by itself. Uh, that might be bad to some of y'all, but who cares? I topped. <laughs> Got him. Let him know. Uh, Best logic yep, ever. Yep. I, I played two Dark Hole because board wipes are good right now. 
Uh, I played, it was supposed to be two chalice, but my friend replaced it with a Tori in the side. I don't know why. Uh, it's supposed to be two chalice. Two I never chal sided in the chalice in, so I would actually replace them. So. Uh, uh, I played three twin. I sided this in a lot, like against everything. Uh, it was pretty dang good. Uh, and I decided to anti spell. I don't know how I feel about this card right now. Like it can lock you out. It can lock your opponent out if like you have the ability to. But then you can also lock yourself out if they don't clear it. Yeah. Which is what happened to me in top. Was why I lost. Yeah, so I mean, it, it's a good card to lock people out. But beware of killing yourself. For sure, man. Any shout outs you want to give, man? Uh, yeah. Shout out to Aaron McKinnis uh, from uh, House of Champions. He had like he helped me theory the deck, give me all along the way. Uh, my friend Darian Craig and my friend Aiden Clark, they also helped Theory. They they kept preaching to me the consistency was key, and that was the way I topped. Uh, Your channel? Besides that, I mean, uh, yeah. shout out to Levier Dragon. Uh, yeah, we don't really know. make videos anymore, but uh, there might be one because I topped. There you go. Hey. Uh, <laughs> Come back. Yep. Um, uh, besides that, just shout out to pretty much everyone from Austin. Y'all all helped me out with my playtesting. And uh, shut up, Renee. Uh, <laughs> uh, shut up. <laughs> I appreciate letting me borrow cards. Besides that, you know, just uh, that's pretty much it. All right, all right man. man. For sure. Congratulations. Congrats. Thank you.